Sambal is a hot sauce or paste typically made from a mixture of a variety of chili peppers with secondary ingredients such as shrimp paste, fish sauce, garlic, ginger, shallot, scallion, palm sugar, lime juice, and rice vinegar or other vinegars. Sambal is an Indonesian loan word of Javanese origin, sambal. It is native to the cuisines of Indonesia, Malaysia, Sri Lanka, Brunei and Singapore. It has also spread through overseas Indonesian populations to the Netherlands and Suriname. Various recipes of sambals usually are served as hot and spicy condiments for dishes, such as lalab, raw vegetables, ikan bakar, grilled fish, ikan goreng, fried fish, ayam goreng, fried chicken, ayam panyet, smashed chicken, iga panyet, ribs, and various soto soup. Preparation and availability Traditional sambals are freshly made using traditional tools, such as a stone pestle and mortar. Sambal can be served raw or cooked. The chili pepper, garlic, shallot and tomato are often freshly ground using a mortar, while the terassi or belican shrimp paste, is fried or burned first to kill its pungent smell as well as to release its aroma. Sambal might be prepared in bulk, as it can be easily stored in a well-sealed glass jar in the refrigerator for a week to be served with meals as a condiment. However, some households and restaurants insist on making freshly prepared sambal just a few moments prior to consuming in order to ensure its freshness and flavor. This is known as sambal dadic lit. Impromptu sambal. Or. Freshly made sambal. Nevertheless, in most warung and restaurants, most sambal is prepared daily in bulk and offered as a hot and spicy condiment. Today some brands of prepared, prepacked, instant, or ready-to-use sambal are available in Warung, traditional markets, supermarkets and convenience stores. Most are bottled sambal, with a few brands available in plastic or aluminum sachet packaging. Compared to traditional sambals, bottled instant sambals often have a finer texture, more homogeneous content, and thicker consistency, like tomato ketchup, due to the machine-driven manufacturing process. Traditionally made sambals ground in a pestle and mortar usually have a coarse texture and consistency. Several brands produce bottled sambals, among others are Hoi Fong Foods Sambal Olek, Heinz ABC Sambal Terasi and several variants of Sambal Indifood. Varieties of chili The most common kinds of peppers used in sambal are Aduma, also known as habanero, a very spicy, yellow, and block-shaped pepper. Cayenne pepper, a shiny, red, and elongated pepper. Madame Jeanette, a yellow light green, elongated, irregularly shaped pepper. Bird's eye chili, also known as cave rawit in Javanese, a very spicy, green-red, elongated pepper approximately 10 mm in, wide and 50 mm in, long. Chili peppers known as lombok in Javanese, a mild, green-red, elongated pepper. Green chili peppers are milder than red ones. Cave taliwang, a pepper spicier than the bird's eye chili, similar in spiciness to the Naga Jalakia, its name is supposedly the origin from which Lombok Island, or the island of the chili, derives its name. Indonesia In the Indonesian archipelago, there are as many as 300 varieties of sambal. The intensity ranges from mild to very hot. Some varieties include Sambal andaliman Similar to sambal lado mudo but with the addition of andaliman pepper. Sambal asam This is similar to sambal terasi with an addition of tamarind concentrate. Asam means tamarind or sour in Indonesian. Sambal bajak, bajak. Banten sambal Chili, or another kind of red pepper, fried with oil, shallot, garlic, terasi, candlenuts, palm sugar and other condiments. This is darker and richer in flavor than sambal asam. Sambal balado Manangkabau style sambal. Chili pepper or green chili is blended together with garlic, shallot, red or green tomato, salt and lemon or lime juice, then sautéed with oil. Sambal bua 
lit fruit sambal, specialty of palambang, made from the mixture of chili, shrimp paste, kamong, a type of mango, and pineapple. Sambal Sibic A sambal recipe specialty of Sibic Village, Garrett Regency, West Java. It consists of coarsely chopped and ground green bird's eye chili, green raw tomato, shallot, galangal, lemon basil, shrimp paste and salt. Sambal Kolo Kolo from Ambon, it consists of Indonesian ketchup manis, sweet soy sauce, chili, tomatoes bits, shallots and lime it has a chiefly sweet taste. It is suitable for barbecue dishes. Some variations will add butter or vegetable oil to the sambal. Sambal Dabu 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 comes close to the Mexican salsa sauce, it is of Manado. S origin. It consists of coarsely chopped tomatoes, calamansi are known as lemon cui or jurik kestori, shallots, chopped bird. SI chili, red chili, basil, poured with hot vegetable oil, salt. Sambal durian or sambal tempoyak. It is made from fermented durian called tempoyak. The fermentation process takes three to five days. The chili and the tempoyak may be readily mixed or served separately, to cater the individual preference in ratio of chili to tempoyak to determine the scale of hotness. This sambal is available in two varieties, raw and cooked. In the cooked variety, pounded chilies, shallots and lemongrass are stir-fried with anchovies, tempoyak and turmeric leaf for aroma. Patai and tapioca shoots are also frequently added. The sweet sour hot sambal can be found in Sumatra and Kalimantan, Indonesian Borneo, especially in Palembang and Bengkulu, and also in Malay Peninsula. Sambal Gandaria Freshly ground sambal terasi with shredded gandaria, a kind of tropical fruit native to Southeast Asia. Sambal goreng Literally means. Fried sambal. It is a mix of crisp fried red shallots, red and green chili, shrimp paste and salt, briefly stir-fried in coconut oil. It can be made into a whole different dish by adding other ingredients, such as sambal goreng ati mixed with diced liver, or sambal goreng udang added with small shrimp. Sambal jengit Sambal with an addition of grated coconut, similar to urap. Sambal jengkal Freshly ground sambal terasi mixed with sliced fried jengkal, a kind of tropical bean with slightly stinky aroma native to Southeast Asia. Sambal jengkal can be found in Sundanese and Siriban cuisine. Sambal kalasan Sometimes also called sambal jawa. Similar to sambal tumis, it is stir-fried. It uses a heapful of palm sugar which gives its dark brown color, tomato, spices and chili. The overall flavor is sweet, with mild hints of spices and chili. Sambal kakang A mixture of chili with garlic, shallot, sugar, salt, crushed fried peanuts, and water. Usually used as condiments for nasi uduk, ketan, or otak otak. The simple version only employ cave rawit chili, crushed fried peanuts and water. Sambal ketchup a sambal consists of Indonesian ketchup manis, sweet soy sauce, red chili, tomatoes bits, shallots and lime. It has a sweet and spicy taste and usually used for barbecue dishes. Sambal kamiri This is similar to sambal terasi with an addition of candlenuts. Sambal lado mudo or sambal ijo Literally a Manangkabau word for green sambal. It is also known as sambal hiu or sambal ijo, also. Green sambal. Sambal lado mudo, a West Sumatran specialty, used green chili, with dried shrimp, red shallots, garlic, and spices. It is one of those taste sensations that's hard to beat with a unique fresh flavor that complements the richness of Sumatran food so extremely well. The sambal is stir-fried. Sambal mato raw shallot and lemongrass sambal of Bali origin. It contains a lot of finely chopped shallots, chopped bird's eye chili, lemongrass, cooking oil with a dash of lime juice. 
Sambal patay A mixture of red chili, garlic, shallot, and patay green stinky bean as the main ingredients. Sambal pettis An East Javanese sambal uses chili, pettis, a kind of shrimp paste, peanuts, young banana, herbs and spices. Sambal pensit, manga muda Green mango sambal from Central Java. Freshly ground sambal terasi with shredded young unripe mango. This is a good accompaniment to seafood. Pensit means young mango in Indonesian. Sambal plekking Originating from Lombok Island, the sambal consists of Lombok's chili variety and Lombok. S. Lenkari shrimp paste, tomatoes, salt, and lime juice. Sambal Rika Rika A hot sambal from Manado region, it uses ginger, chili, lemon and spices. Suitable for barbecue meats and chicken. Sambal Roa Spicy smoked roa fish, halfbeak, sambal from Manado region, North Sulawesi. Sambal Rujik Rujik spicy sauce, made from palm sugar, tamarind, chili pepper and shrimp paste. Sambal sedan A very hot sambal with Madame Jeanette peppers, red-brownish, very sharp. The name literally means, devil's sauce. It is popular in Surabaya. Sambal taliwang this variant is native to Taliwang, a village near Mataram, Lombok Island, and is made from Naga Jalakia pepper grown specially in Lombok, garlic and Lombok shrimp paste. A kilogram of Naga Jalakia pepper is extracted, ground and pressed. This is mixed with ground garlic and shrimp paste, then cooked with vegetable oil. Sambal Tauko a Sulawesi sambal, contains the Chinese tauco, lime juice, chili, brown sugar, and salt. Sambal terasi A common Indonesian style of sambal. Similar to the Malaysian belican, but with a stronger flavor, since terasi is more tangy and fermented. Red and green peppers, terasi, sugar, salt, lemon or lime juice, tangy, strong. One version omits the lime juice and has the sambal fried with pounded tomatoes. Popularly eaten raw. Alternate spelling in the Netherlands, trasi or trasi. Sambal teri lado A padang, West Sumatra, speciality. Sambal is made using chili pepper, tomato, shallot, spices, and mixed with salted ikan teri anchovy. The sambal is stir-fried and similar to Malay. Sambal ikan. Sambal tomat Similar to sambal tumis but with the addition of crushed tomato and sugar. It can be served as fresh sambal or stirred sambal. The tomato is stir-fried along with the other ingredients until a paste-like consistency. The overall taste is hot and sweet. It is a good mix with lalapan. For very young children, sambal tomat sometimes use very little or no chili at all. It is regarded as one of the first steps in introducing children to the taste of Indonesian sambal. Sambal tuktuk is a batak andaliman, Sichuan pepper, an asoaso fish dried and preserved mackerel, sambal from North Sumatra. Sambal tumis Chili fried with belican shrimp paste, onions, garlic, tamarind juice. Tumis means stir fry. Often the cooking oil is remixed with the sambal. It may be mixed with other ingredients to produce dishes such as sambal kangkong, sambal kumi, squid, and sambal teller egg. Sambal udang bawang. A specialty sambal from Surabaya. It is one of Indonesia's super hot sambal. It used simple ingredients, such as chili pepper, shallot, garlic, asam jawa tamarind, and coconut oil. People of Surabaya often called it nyalik sambal, as they eat it with fragrant steamed white rice. Sambal yulik, olek Raw chili paste, bright red, thin and sharp tasting. Can be used as the base for making other sambals or as an ingredient for other cuisines. Some types of this variant call for the addition of salt or lime into the red mixture. 
Olek is a Dutch spelling which in modern Indonesian spelling has become simply Ulek, both have the same pronunciation. Kobik is Indonesian special stoneware derived from common village basalt stone kitchenware still ubiquitous in kitchens, particularly in Java. The kobik is a mortar shaped like a hybrid of a dinner and soup plate with an old, cured bamboo root or stone pestle, ulik or ulikon, employed in an ulik manner, a crushing and twisting motion, like using a screwdriver, for crushing lime leaves, chilies, peppers, shallots, peanuts, and other kinds of ingredients. Sambal strawberry A sambal made with strawberries originated from Bandung, West Java. Usually served to accompany breaded fish cutlet. Sambal Uya Lombok A kind of sambal which is only made from raw chili and salt. Very simple and easy to make, and usually be eaten with steamed rice and fried foods like fried chicken. Malaysia Sambal Belikan A Malay-style sambal. Fresh chilies are pounded together with toasted shrimp paste belican, in a stone mortar to which sugar and lime juice are added. Originally, Lamau Kestori or Calamansi lime, is used but since this is scarce outside of Southeast Asia, normal lime is used as a replacement. Tomatoes are optional ingredients. Sometimes, sweet sour mangoes or equivalent local fruits are also used. It can be eaten with cucumbers or ulam leafy herbs, in a meal of rice and other dishes. A Malaysian Chinese version is to fry belican with chili. Sambal jerik Green or red pepper with kaffir lime. In Malaysia, it is called sili, chili, jerik pickle. Sometimes vinegar and sugar are substituted for the lime. Used as a condiment with fried rice and noodle-based dishes. Sambal tempoyak This sambal exists in two varieties, raw and cooked. Raw sambal tempoyak is prepared from fresh chilies pounded together with dried anchovies and served with fermented durian tempoyak. The sambal and the tempoyak may be readily mixed or served separately, so that the person eating can determine the ratio of sambal to tempoyak that they want. Tempoyak has a sweet sour taste that offsets the hotness of the chili. In the cooked variety, pounded chilies, shallots and lemongrass are stir-fried with anchovies, tempoyak and turmeric leaf for aroma. Commonly found in Pahang and Perak of Peninsular Malaysia, sambal tempoyak could be found also at Sumatra. Patai parkia speciosa and tapioca shoots are also frequently added. Sambal kaikap Made from mixed of sweet soya sauce, shallot, garlic, bird's eye chili for any fried dishes especially for fried banana, fried tempeh or condiment for soto and bihan soup. Sambal goreng Dishes consist of tempeh, anchovies, peanut fried together with sambal until dried. Sambal patai Sambal kakang Condiment for satay. Sambal tok tok Sweet sambal this is a sambal made from dried chilies, fresh chilies, belican and gula malaka palm sugar, as main ingredients. Sweet sambal is traditionally served with nasi lemak and also side dishes fried crispy anchovies, toasted peanuts, boiled egg and cucumber. Sri Lanka Sini sambal This is a sambal of the Sri Lankan cuisine that includes onion, crumbled Maldive fish, and spices as its main ingredients. Its name, also spelled as Sini sambal, and Sini sambal is derived from the local word for sugar. Whole sambal, thangkai sambal. This is a sambal made of scraped coconut, whole and thangkai mean coconut in Sinhala and Tamil, respectively, onion, green chili, red chili powder, and lime juice as its main ingredients. Sometimes, crumbled Maldive fish is also added, and tomatoes can be used instead of lime juice for flavor. Lunu miris, kata smabal. The name, Lunu Miris, can be literally translated as salt chili, and is a paste of red chili pounded with sea salt. A widespread derivative is kata sambal, which adds onions, crumbled Maldive fish, salt, and lime juice to the chili and salt mixture, balai kai sambal. 
This is a sambal made of boiled and mashed plantain, scraped coconut, chopped green chilies and onion, salt and lime juice. Balai Kai means unripe plantain in Sri Lankan Tamil. Dishes Sambal can also be used as an ingredient to a dish, which uses a large amount of chili peppers. In Padang cuisine, any dishes started with balado, lit with chili pepper, indicate the sambal mixed dish. Dishes bearing the word sambal include Sambal sotong With cuttlefish Sambal udang curing With dried prawns, also known in Penang as Sambal hay b Sambal lengkong With ikan parang, wolf herring Sambal goreng teri kakang with anchovy and peanuts Sambal goreng curing tempe With tempeh Sambal goreng ati With cow's liver, potato, and sometimes patai Sambal goreng udang Or sambal shrimp, with fresh shrimp, also known as udang balado Sambal radio a traditional dish from Sarawak, it is an omelette mixed with fried belican and anchovies. Sambal ikan A Malay-style dish prepared from fish and spices and cooked until the fish loses its shape. Available in varieties, some are in the shape of dry fish floss known as surrounding ikan, and some are moist such as sambal ikan bilis, anchovies, or sambal ikan tongkal, skipjack tuna. Sambal dodging, surrounding dodging A Malay-style sambal prepared from meat and spices and cooked for more than four hours until the meat loses its shape, similar to meat floss. See also Balado, Minang-style sambal goreng Hot sauce, also known as chili sauce or pepper sauce Indonesian cuisine Malaysian cuisine Nam Frik, the Thai equivalent of sambal Singaporean cuisine Peranakan cuisine Filipino cuisine References <laughs>